Mini Blocks, Plays. Hello, welcome to Mini Blocks Plays, Alex Kidd in something or other Enchanted Land, which is on the Sega Mega Drive. In the Enchanted Castle, see? Enchanted Land, Enchanted Castle, you've got Aladdin, Alex Kidd, who was one of the Beatles a long time, and some guy with the cone on his face. Hi, I'm Alex Kidd. I live on the planet Ares, my brother Eagle is king. Frankly, my life is uneventful, but then I heard a rumor. My last father, King Thor, was alive on the planet Paper Rock. Why is it named Paper Rock? Because everyone there is an expert at the game called Paper Rock. Scissors. <laughs> oh, it's taking scissors out. If a visitor is no good at that game, he won't last long. My family didn't want me to go, but I have to find out. Is my father still alive? Or has he been papered to his stone, rocked to his scissors, scissors to his paper? Only one way to find out I never knew. There was such a deep thaw, thaw, a deep, uh, such a deep lineage to Alex Kidd, a deep thaw. What was I even trying to say? Punch this, pick up money, punch a car. Alex Kidd is dead, everyone. Funny enough, kids cannot defeat vehicles with brute force. Or can he? He can! And to celebrate, he wins a gold coin. But this is how things work in Alex Kid. You need to then go and do the rock, paper, scissors game on planet Paper Rock. And see if you get to win some money and or keep your life. Because if you fail it, you die. Beat me at the game and I'll give you a gift. Bet 50 whatever they are coins absolutely will you bet your life of course i will who wouldn't pick paper rock or scissors okay before the music stops ready i'm gonna go with my trusty scissors i bet i can beat that guy look at him he's no idea what he's doing Damn. Not your lucky day, is it? Nope. Now it is dead. And that's how things are decided on planet Paper Rock. I agree. This time, I'm going to be crafty. Scissors. And I won. It's easy to earn money in Alex Kid, as long as you stay alive. Now I'm really unsure what to bet. Uh, stone! No! Welcome to a very eventful Let's Play. The one-eyed paper... One-eyed paper. It's bet money then and not my life. <coughs> The little bear in there with the uh, the eye patch, who was uh, a cheerleader going crazy for the uh, ape man. Very, very unusual set of circumstance here in Alex Kid Land, the land of the enchanted castle, of which I can't see one. This is, I believe, is this the same game on the Sega Master System? I feel like it is, but only you don't have to go through the annoying level. Yeah, I'm fine. Do you know what? No, it's not. It's not worth a hundred coin. I can get a hundred coin by punching a car. Well, I can get somewhat of a hundred coins. Or you can kick things in the air and move on to uh, the, the, the prairie, where you get to punch animals in the face. 
and dung beetles who kill you instantly. It's a very, very strange game is Alex Kidd. This is the uh, only version of Alex Kidd that I've ever actually played. There's this one and the one that comes bundled with your Sega Master System 2. The, uh, the, uh, the only two Alex Kidd games I've ever played and I do kind of believe that they are actually the same game. Not not 100% guarantee, but more or less 100% guarantee that they are the same game. This on the Sega Mega Drive is the... I was trying to jump over it. What's the point jumping over it? I could just... Although I need to get that. Ooh, that'll loop. The Sega Mega Drive one that I have is part of a four-pack game that no, it, that comes with um, Altered Beast, which I played very successfully last week, and uh, Flicky, which I barely remember, and um, Gunstar Heroes, which is a game that I can't wait to go back to, because Gunstar Heroes is awesome. Nuts. How are you supposed to get that one? Maybe if I jump on here, maybe if I jump on... Oh, no, no, never mind. Maybe if I jump... Maybe if I... Jump, there we go. Nope, nope. I could just... What's the point? I can already jump higher. <laughs> I guess I'm gonna have to kick my way through. <laughs> Worth it. Game over. Alex Kidd, everyone. It's a very... What would you call it? Pain in the ass kind of game. Time to play Alex Kidd again. How are you even supposed to get very far in this game? Because it seems like it's just not worth playing it. <laughs> oh, no! That's called the panic kick when everything goes horribly wrong. Score! Take the money and run, Alex. Run like your life was the running place to go. Oh my god, I can't. Thank goodness Sega changed the mascot to Sonic. Because although Sonic has relatively frustrating uh, gameplay mechanics, Alex Kidd is the utter worst. Like, it's, it's got charm, it's got nice elements about it, but it's uh, incredibly frustrating. I don't know why I insisted on punching him. But it's just... It's such a pain for, like, your immediate death, basically. Your one-hit kills are frustrating, funny enough.
I don't even know about them, is it? Mr. Eagle? I don't even care. Funny enough, there is an eagle, and funny enough, I think it is election day over in America. Today, filming it, there was a otter, beaver, prairie dog, and a hedgehog. Take that, Sonic. Alex is dead. I've nearly got a thousand coins! I used to say this game was good. And there goes that one. I hate you so much, Hedgehog Man. Oh, Prairie Dog. To the face. Game over. And so I seem to be getting on better, obviously when I'm not trying to do running commentary. Which is obviously where this is gonna really fall apart, because I'm doing... I, mean, I got a life! Things are picking up! Ugh! Things are going downhill drastically fast. I'm getting rich out of it. Come on, Alex! No! Alex Kid sucks. Every time! Stupid hedgehogs! Now you don't know what's going to hit you, bro! I knew that was coming up! I barely even got... That was a waste of a bike. Have I got anything else? No. Alex Kidd, everyone. Drive a motorcycle into some blobs and then walk into the face of a prairie dog and die. Now I need to get to the life or the end of the level before this is over. And trust me, I've quit this Let's Play a number of times today. Because that was a really lucky save. Because Alex Kidd, ladies and gentlemen, is not as good as it remembers it should have been. I got a health. And there it goes. Prairie Dog to the foot. Alex Kid is down! At least my money's going up. But there's no places I can go to spend it. And there's certainly no joy in trying to complete the game. Oh, 
I knew it would be a bomb! Whoa! Take that, Hedgehog. My coin. Really? I should easily have hit that. Forget it. I made it to the end of the level, everyone! Now let's go get myself a helicopter. But I want the helicopter. Duncan. Really? This is not going well. Duncan. Which is why I'm going to choose rock and lose again. Duncan. I hate it when we get double. Duncan. Yay, I got the helicopter. Take that, you gorilla man. Eyepatch Bear is crying, and Alex Kidd progresses to level 3, the Splashy Sea. I hate this level, but luckily I'm going to use a helicopter. I feel like this wasn't such a good idea. No! Oh, nuts. Why are the spinning turtles? Was actually much easier. Alex Kid, everyone. Thank you very much for watching my video. Make sure to hit that subscribe button down below to stay up the latest from my channel. You can find me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and Pinterest under mini blocks. What else would it be? And if you want to see another really bad Let's Play, then you can go find my Let's Play Vaulted Beast from last week over on Mini Blocks Plays. Or you can go find me play Road Rash 3 on the Sega Mega Drive, also on Mini Blocks Plays. But for everything else, Sega, retro video games, toys, and pretty bad let's plays make sure to keep it locked to mini block